Hey guys, what's up, Snapheads here, bringing you guys another video, and this is a video on how to record in HD quality your YouTube videos without a capture card on your Xbox One and on your PS4, not on your Xbox 360 or your PS3. Sorry about that, this is only for next-gen consoles, and let's get right into it, starting off with the Xbox One, which has two methods. So like I said for the Xbox One you have two methods, for the first method just double tap your home button, go all the way down to Twitch, as you guys saw on the screen the home button is the big button right there I circled, you guys probably all know what it is but for those of you guys that don't I put it on the screen and then once you're in Twitch go all the way down to broadcast and just wait it takes a bit to load, not really that long like two minutes or one minute, not really that long at all actually I don't know what I'm saying and then title the video recording so people know you're recording, be sure to let people know you're recording because people come by and they're like hi they think you're live streaming or just do it on a backup twitch account which you usually don't use for live streaming and then uh basically that's it just go do whatever you want i'm playing nhl here so i'm gonna go into hockey ultimate team and open up a pack but you guys can do whatever you want this works with any game like i said this is not only for nhl well i tried opening up pack and it didn't work and then once you're done streaming just click stop streaming and then go on to twitch.com sign into your twitch account click on your name click on video manager and that's it. Then you look for your name, look for your video, and once you find your video, click export on it, and then title it whatever you want so you know what it is when you get onto your YouTube account. Title it, like, I titled it Xbox One because I'm going to show you guys how to do it on the PS4 too. Be sure to make it unlisted so only you could see it on YouTube and no one else. Go onto your YouTube account and just, there's the video, just click on the video, it's titled Xbox One. Copy the link to it, go to keepwith.com, the link to that will be in the description, as well as any other thing I use in this video. Paste it, click download on the top right thing, and then be sure to click 720p so your video doesn't get bad quality like 420. 720p is like the, the best way you can do it, sadly you can't do 180p with the these methods in this video. And then here's the HD video you guys just saw. See I clicked on Hockey Ultimate Team, then I got disconnected to from the servers. And two methods to record your audio for this is, if you want live audio, just do these methods. So first is just click play on your iPhone, and this is what it sounds like. So this is what it sounds like just with the iPhone and its built-in microphone. And then once you're done, just stop recording, and that's it. The quality was so bad, so I suggest you guys use your Xbox headset if you don't have a microphone like I do. So for the Xbox headset, just plug it into where you plug in your earphones for the iPhone or whatever phone you have, and just go to video camera and start recording. And that's pretty much it. Then just upload it from you to YouTube from your video camera, and there's your audio for both methods. But if you want to record it another way, like if you hit a really sick clip on Call of Duty or get a really sick goal, Double tap the home button right after you hit the clip or get a goal and then click X and that's pretty much it. Your clip has been downloaded onto your clip is on your Xbox account now. Then go to xboxdvr.com which is a website I will leave in the description. Search your gamer tag, mine's obviously Red Wings Forever 1 and then click on view game clip not screenshots because obviously you want the game clip and then go to your game clip, mine's right there since I recorded other stuff. Click on download, and that's pretty much it. It starts downloading as you guys see. It takes like however long the video is. I mean, for Xbox, it only records the last 30 seconds. So here it is. So you gotta really, like, if you hit a shot, you gotta, you gotta quickly click the home button twice and then click X. And if you get a really sick call, you gotta quickly do it because it only records the last 30 seconds. So now let's get onto the PS4 side, which has three methods, and the Xbox One only had two. So yeah, let's get right into it. So like I said, the PS4 has three methods. The first method is double clicking the share button as seen on the screen. That's the share button, the circle button. And then you start recording and once you see the thing on the top left with the red thing, that means you started recording. So be sure to see that before anything just so you don't miss your file. And then it just starts recording and go do whatever you want. Like I said, it works for every game. I'm playing NHL right now, so I'm going to go open up a pack to entertain you guys, obviously, because that's the only thing NHL gets views on. But you can do it with anything. Like I said, it works for all games. And then once you're done, you click the share button again once this time, and then you're done. Then you go to capture gallery on your 
PS4, then you click on the game you want it on, obviously I just played NHL 16, so I'm going to click on that, you look for your clip, it's probably the first one there, obviously since you just recorded it, plug in your USB since you need that for this, so you need a USB, click the option button, then click copy to USB, click on it, and then click copy. And then this takes a bit of a long time because my video was like 10 seconds long, like one minute long, and it takes three minutes to do it, but I sped it up for you guys for the sake of the video. Unplug the USB, then plug your USB onto your computer, go to the USB on your computer, click PS4, click share, go to video clips, go to NHL 16 or whatever game you recorded it on, and the video clip is going to be the only one there unless you recorded a lot of videos, which you should delete right after so you don't get confused, but there is a video clip in HD quality that was in 720p, and once again, to record your audio, just use your Xbox headset or your microphone on your phone, I suggest the Xbox headset since it's way better quality. But here's the second method, it's the same as the Xbox method like I showed you guys before for Twitch, but this one's a bit different I'll get to that later so basically all you do is go to twitch go to like title the thing recording obviously so people know you're recording like I said before and then put it to best quality so you get 720p and then start recording as you guys saw on the top right it said on air and whenever someone comes to the stream or someone comments in the chat it shows you guys that that's why I say it's a bit different it also shows it in the video clip so it's really annoying but once you're done recording click the share button go to the twitch thing and click stop recording stop broadcasting and that's pretty much it you're done and then like i did before you go to twitch.tv but like i said this works better with the xbox one so i suggest you guys use like the share button feature and then you just go to twitch.com go to video manager you look for your video you click export on it and i have a lot of videos here since i recording a l i record a lot of videos using this method on the xbox one title it ps4 so you know what video it is or whatever you want to title it Put it unlisted, be sure to put it unlisted so no one else sees it. Copy the link off of YouTube, then go to keepbit.com. Like I said, I'll put the link to that and Xbox TV in the description and whatever I talk about in this video. Be sure to click 720p once again so you don't get a 480p quality video. And then it's done. And then you can go put it onto your editing software and just edit the video. And here's the video in 720p without any audio on it. But if you want to mash up your audio, just go edit the video however you want. But here's the video just in 720p. Like I said, that's the best quality it could be in. If you guys got 180p, go buy an Elgato or something. Then use an Xbox headset or your iPhone once again to record your audio, I suggest the Xbox headset. Third and final method for the PS4, it's sort of like the Xbox's final method as well. So basically all you do is once you get something cool is click the share button, go to upload video clip, not upload screenshot, and then that's pretty much it. Click on the game you recorded it on, plug in your USB, and then once your USB is plugged in, just go look for the video clip. Once you found it, click up copy to USB like we showed you guys before. It takes a long time, so I sped it up for you guys. Like I said, it usually takes a long time. It takes a like, time series of how much of the video length is. And then unplug the USB out of your PS4, plug it into your computer, go to the USB, click PS4, click share, click video clip, and go to the game you recorded on. I recorded it on NHL 16. So I clicked on NHL 16. It should be the only video there. And if it's not, like delete the other videos you have there so it's easier to you to work around them. And then here's the HD quality of the video. Like I said, it's 720p only, but look how crispy clear it is. It's not that bad, guys. Like I said, 720 is how the quality of all my videos. You guys might think it's bad compared to 180p, but it's actually amazing. Especially if you don't have a capture card, this is perfect. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much the video. If this helped you at all, please hit the like button. And let me know any concerns you guys have or if this helped you down in the comments. Be sure to subscribe. And yeah, guys, peace. Squad, so you know I got a Uber full of bitches. Uber full of bitches. Uber.